But he looks like a lollipop. And again. <laughs> uh oh, it's raining. Hallelujah. Kill him. Hey, Kill Emily, him. what's up? York, we found Thomas. Ah, uh, he's at his house, right? How did you know that? Intuition. Good time. Yeah, uh, that works too. Just get in. Let's get a move on. See, at this point, Emily is so considerate that she lets uh, York drive. Are you sure about that, York? Well, I, I will trust him. I think York, you know, has a good judgment on this. It also has to do with the fact that York doesn't want to reveal to you what he's figured out by this point. Mm hmm. Because he, 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 again, swear he wants to give the player a chance to solve it in his own head. So yeah, oh, I get I get, that. I get that this is not even one of those uh, um, murder mysteries of that, that treats the viewer, or in this case, the player, uh, like an idiot, and then basically pulls the convenient um, evidence at the last second that uh, that basically have uh, the person that the protagonist to figure out the 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 mystery all the viewers could have never because we didn't know about that piece of information mm. it's a bit complicated to explain so let me let me use an example that works all the time murder she wrote a lot of bad <laughs> episodes of murder she wrote uh, has this kind of thing where jessica has this last minute revelation that the viewer both doesn't know and then she tells uh, the fact that uh, um, that was this uh, and that's why the murder could be a particular person but the viewer had no idea because they didn't know about that and this particular thing is discussed and kind of deconstructed in a parody movie of murder mysteries i forgot what it's called in english um but it's it's an interesting parody movie um that basically it's climax having this bunch of uh, investigators coming up with this their own kind of you know revelation that saying oh the murder was this person that we had never mentioned before or no the murder was this other because there was this piece of evidence that we found and then it turns out to that uh, no the murder was actually another person entirely that the viewer probably had guessed until that point so that was kind of the payoff um i'll search in the meantime what's the english name is uh, but uh, go on in the meantime hmm. you you also notice uh, i don't think i've mentioned this before that whenever we're in a specific part of the game where there's like some urgent driving section like the one we're doing right now um, the game will p temporarily give you infinite am infinite gas and infinite uh, like and no damage to your car <coughs> just to make sure you get there yeah it, it's again it's similar to the previous uh, thing that we mentioned about uh, not allowing you to do side stuff because it's basically the game telling you to focus uh, on this point because it's important uh, There we go, found it. Uh, Murder by Death, uh, 1976, uh, made by Robert Moore, which has an interesting cast, uh, David Neven and uh, P and Peter Sellers, uh, and also um, Ooh, oh, Peter Falk that's, as well. That's the, second, that's the second movie I recall that had both David Niven and Peter Sellers in it. Mm -hmm. I actually mm -hmm. like it, but I haven't seen the English version properly, and if I recall correctly, it might have aged Poorly because one of the one of the investigators uh, is supposed to be a parody of an investigator of Chinese origin, which you can imagine what kind of jokes they would make. And Peter Falk is supposed to be the hardball noir detective. And if I recall correctly, at some point they make the, they make talks about homosexuality, and well, you can imagine what the dialogue might have been for the time. But again, I'll need to rewatch it again at some point. Mm -hmm. Oh, and look, Fiona is uh, uh, driving. Outside? Why? Uh, maybe she was. Maybe she was driving. There's home. Georgia. All right, there you go, Thomas's house. Alright, George, how serious is the situation? 
I sent Emily to get you right away. No idea who made the call? No. That's why I came on ahead. Anonymous. A light did come on, but only for a second. I saw a tall male silhouette mm. in the window. It was Thomas. Okay. I'm going in. You two wait here. We'll be ready to burst in at any moment. Just call out. All right. So if your guns don't get uh, affected by the rain. Zach, it's the same in the countryside after all. The climax of an investigation. <laughs> yeah. I mean, why yeah. not? Well, uh, yeah. look at it. Look at it this way, York. In this case, you can be the guy yelling FBI open up this time. Oh boy, combat sequence. That's the thing, Jova. It's not. I don't even understand why the hell they Wait, had that what? loading screen there. <laughs> So the game just had one thing that it was consistent about. The sequence is not even well, right to the dark. Well, Java, we can't world. have that now, can we? <laughs> no, I mean, the sequence in general is not even tied to the other world, even without combat. No, it's not. No. Well, well, as you can see, too, there's no vines, there's no, you know. Yeah, there's no splatter, no rust. The music's not even fitting properly for us. No, well, that's because there's a disc. Maybe, yeah. maybe, maybe it was an oversight by the programmers, I don't know. Again, that's the thing about this game. Even when they finally get something that's logical and consistent, they eradicate even that. All right, so let's listen. so let's see what he was listening. Oh, of course, his sister's song. Let's profile the song. <laughs> Why not? Hmm. Ugh, this one's coming in very murky. Well, we don't have any. Well, we don't. Well, we don't have any clues yet. So. Yeah. Well, I know, but it feels even murkier than the other ones for some reason. Probably this is what happens when you buy cheap that, uh, I can actually explain. <laughs> I, I can actually explain to you, Jova, that the reason they're not showing you, the reason it's maybe a bit more grainy, is because yeah. Swear is trying to keep spoilers away from you for just a little bit more. And even in universe, he's told, uh, you know. Um, York huh. is telling that their piece we're Oh, look at that, guys. It's too great. We found Thomas's Thomas biscuit, biscuit trading card. Very mm, nice. Yummy. Also, Tom keeps a mannequin in his apartment. That Intr is a chunky biscuit. Oh, I think it looks more like a It is. Tree. It is, Shiroi, but it's the best piece of food in the game. <laughs> <laughs> well, Shiroi, there's a reason why York praises, praises it so much. Hold on. Ah, a red wig. A red wig, huh? Well... Let's see. Yeah, it, it's it's supposed to be red, but the actual model of it is on the on the game in is brown. Shots, but it, in whatever. Some, in some shots it look red. I don't get. The... Maybe it's just like a deep red. Someone... It's not meant to be bright, bright red or anything. That or someone screwed up in the art team. <laughs> <laughs> All are very possible. <laughs> or maybe not oh. at the same time. Oh. No, the, the killer was just chilling. Um. So the killer may have been is wearing that, that is, wig. Is the killer dark side is just chilling on people's couches? Hmm. I mean, villains need to vibe too. Goodness. <laughs> well, judging from that shot, he was also manspreading Shiro, so it's... why not? Oh, cool. We but... can shave and change our clothes here. That totally won't corrupt the crime Oh, empty scene. fridge. And we found a cherry uh, pie. On the, on the what, the, what, what, what was the cherry pie doing in the fridge? Like, <laughs> I mean, isn't that the better place for it? <laughs> Like okay. for leftovers, I guess. So. They're that... considering, you know, all the other places we found these pies. The fridge is probably the best place to. I guess. Them. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, something on the floor. Let's observe. Ooh, footprints. Oop. A series of boot oh, or boot, pr whatever. Same thing, different name. Boot culprit must have entered this room. You got uh. wet boot prints. So yeah, as you can see, this section is pretty short. It's more it's just an investigation scene, so I don't understand why the hell was that load time screen there. Whatever. <laughs> don't don't ask me, Jova. I don't Oh wait. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. 
Wait. The killer was the one on the couch by the looks of it, but then... Well, he has the raincoat, so obviously that's the raincoat. Well, the second... So the, he... the raincoat killer impersonator, at least. Or the the new raincoat killer. Well, oh, yeah, that, that's what I'm saying, the new one. That's yeah. the same thing, yeah. That, that's well, what, he's a that... raincoat killer impersonator. That's it. That's that. Those are the same people. It's just that we now learn, thanks to Harry, that this raincoat killer that we've that we've been dealing with is imitating the original from fifty years ago. Of course. Oh, so. I forget. Did, did we ever establish what became of the old raincoat killer? Uh, we will later. Because I mean, they never said that the old raincoat killer was ever caught, and they actually will explain oh. what happened, Jova. Don't worry. Interesting. I take it we have not heard the last of Harry. Well, let's see. Ooh, cigarettes. Of course, cigarettes. Heavy. What the? So, ooh, lollipop. Ew. How long has that been there? I don't want to know. Maybe it's still in the wrapper or something. It actually, it, 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 it actually is. If the, if the screenshot of the item itself is to go by, anything to go by, yes, it is. That, right, it's uh, it will still spoil uh, itself over time, though. Exploding. And yeah. we found Thomas's shoes on his bathtub. Okay. Uh, the shoes were found in the bathtub. They are wet, which means the person didn't have time to take them off. Okay. He goes in the shower with this. Well, all the music is overlapping. Maybe this was after a drunken night out. Well, there's, we don't know what happened here. Maybe the reason the shoes are there for a different reason. Um, he, uh, Maybe he was washing them. them. Maybe he was using them to help clean himself for some reason. All right, let's go, <laughs> out. It looked like he was praying to something, but then the raincoat killer came in. Oh, there Someone you go. There you go. See this? On. Apparently. Oh, wait. That I mean, wonder. So, so the so the so the person in the red dress is Thomas. It seems based on based on say, based on these ah. screenshots. I was huh. about to say, maybe Thomas disguised himself as his sister to protect her and to sacrifice himself. Hmm. Interesting theory. Thomas wants us to look around for him a bit more. So there's more to it. Kind of like the bonus footage on a DVD. I hope it's worth watching. <laughs> <laughs> I hope so, York. <laughs> you. Maybe it's just what, maybe it's one of those crappy videos. Oh, hello, you two. We need to seal off all routes out of town. No need for that, George. Huh? If he was going to leave town, he would have done so by now. Yeah, I'm with York. Yeah, if if he still got some. Maybe it's been business. literally days since he disappeared by this point. What was with that sound effect there? Uh, uh, deadly premonition. That, that's a way to sum up this entire game. To be fair. <laughs> <laughs> this game. <clears throat> what was up with that sound effect? Quoted by Jova Hexion Travan Vexion 2020. This game that's, is an that, audio that, that's and a thing. Dream Jova, what, Jova, Jova, what you're asking is a question that people have been asking for the last 10 years. So. <laughs> Some questions are better left unanswered, you know? It's like with the oh. poll. Maybe we. <laughs> I was about to not, say. Just fucking no. <laughs> I was about to say. So, Tsuri, are you and Tio now okay with not knowing what was in the oh, poll? Uh, I'm sorry. For, for a second there, I thought rewinding the game. I never said anything. <laughs> yeah, I never said I was okay with it. I'm just looking at things as they are, you know? <laughs> I can sense the tranquil fury. time to find a way to view bonus switch. Hmm. Uh oh. Do you ever what? get the feeling like you're what? being watched? Whoa! <laughs> what, what was that camera angle? I don't get it. <laughs> All right. That's also Ch another way to All right, so it. chapter twenty, cruel device. Whatever that device well, is. Well, that sounds peachy. So yeah, yeah so apparently so Thomas may have gone cross-dressing. My fear is that he probably did it to protect his sister if he knew she would be next on the list. So that does beg the question: How would he have known? Mm. Yeah, because that would indicate that he had information okay. that we didn't. That that so okay, they, but that doesn't. The that's the thing, Jova. Go ahead, too. I got the printing. If I correctly depicted Anna, 
Becky, uh, Carol, Diane, and Emily. Like, those are, their names begin the language letters of the alphabet. So, well, to, again... Well, Taylor, didn't you notice somebody else in that painting, though? Um, uh, I forgot. There was someone Carol? else, who, there was somebody else wait, who, wait, 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 who had wait, black wait, hair. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Are there literally zombies popping up in the middle of the road now? Rambo Jova, it's midnight. No, actually it's not, no, it's no, 10 no, p.m. No, it, it's not midnight. It's, oh, it's, my bad. I thought, I thought they only showed up around midnight. What that's the heck's a, going on? That's a thing, Jova. Uh, like Taylor would say, things are escalating. Oh, I don't know. Uh, yeah, uh, no, but no. I, I, actually, I actually already forgot uh, who else was in the painting. Sure, let's go I almost there. run you over, you bitch, as those would probably say. <laughs> You'd have been dead twice. I love all the the raincoat just popped on him. Yeah. Of course, it, it, it's, it's 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 a convenient raincoat too. Oh, there she is again. All right, and now we and now we're going to chase Anna throughout the town at the sound of the game's main theme. Oh, pardon me, Mister Zombie. Can anyone else see this? Uh, well, as well, as you can see, well, she way, well, she way, as you can see, the streets are deserted. Hmm. Conveniently yeah. enough, but then again, well, you know, have to clear the roads because of the raincoat killer. So yeah, and I'm guessing you want to follow me, but sorry, you you want me to follow you, sorry, but um. What the heck? What was that man? Solid. Were Again. those shooting stars that fell onto the road? No, 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 no it, that's uh, it's birds, Jova. For some reason, in this part there are birds trying to attack us. I don't understand why. Oh no, it's oh. bird damage. <laughs> Quickly, York, grab a coat hanger. So how do you know where Anna's gonna pop up next? Simple. It, it's actually very simple, Jova. Just keep uh, walking towards where she is, and then when you see her running somewhere and disappearing, go towards that direction. And eventually, and just keep running, and, and you'll eventually see her again. Uh, it's not that hard. Uh, eventually, you'll understand the basic. Just a bit ago, there you go. There, 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 there she is. There you go. See, there she is. Yeah, so I get it. Just keep, just keep a close eye on where Whoa. she's going when she disappears, and that will be your hint as to where to go. Don't worry about the zombies, as you know they're slow, so you can just keep running. And no, the thing I'm worried about are the birds all of a sudden. Jesus. The birds are yelling. Isn't it beautiful? No, no, it's terrible. Looks like the lo looks like the evil of this town is starting to intensify. Thank God zombies oh, I thought you were going to make a problem. Thank God zombies can't go indoors. Unfortunately, I couldn't come up with one. <laughs> they can only go indoors with the when the vines allow them to, apparently. So, Anna, where exactly okay, are you? Now you're literally leading us in circles, Anna. Come on. Don't get me wrong, Anna. I love this theme, but we, you have to bring me somewhere at some point. You know, it, you know, you know. It's funny that you can potentially shoot zombies to the tune of this theme. Oh. Imagine. The sound effect for those birds is terrible. I know, right? It's Imagine. Like the, it's like that demonic bird of the Gideon gets. Uh, at the beginning of the lesson, near the beginning of the Oh dad, god. So, yeah, Shiroi, allow me, Shiro, allow, Shiro, allow me to remind you, Shiroi, that this is the game where squirrels sound like monkeys. So... Yeah, that, that was never <laughs> even brought up again. We haven't found any more squirrels in town, aside so from... This is just a weird town. Something's very wrong with this town. No, uh, you think? I don't know, Joe. What it's makes you say that, Joe? <laughs> You're just exaggerating, come on. Totally. Oh, and um, Carol's bar is closed. Um. <laughs> so, what kind uh, of sound is that for Anna? Uh, I guess Melissa Hutchison can't quite do a teenager voice, I don't know. Uh? <laughs> There's something very bad right behind me, isn't there? Oh, shit! Wow, howdy! Okay, oh. okay, fuck it, let's round the door. Oh, now you say something. Oh. Alright, okay, now, now, now we're getting it, our combat sentence. Now we're getting the combat So there you go. The answer lies in Carol's bar of all places, it seems. Oh god, we're gonna find Carol dead next, aren't we? Let's see. Oh. Yeah, you're okay. I don't think it's gonna hold that much. 
It's okay. York is a I love what he says now, though. Remember, the cigarette keeps him calm. Where's your Jackie go? I, I almost became a goddess of the forest. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> you think might suit me? <laughs> what do you think, Sandy? Oh, God. York as a woman. I'm York. That would be a... Uh... I'm actually surprised uh, that you, that at the very least Teo and Jova didn't notice who was there in that painting uh, we saw in, Ari in Ari's house. Didn't you notice that there was someone with black hair among the among the other... The color that I remember more prominently was wait, the red of the dress, so sorry. Wait, hold on, wait, wait, wait. Is it York's mother? No. Remember, Jova, Pedro already told us that the parents of York has nothing to do with this. It's someone we've known here from Greenvale. That's all, but, uh, but I won't say anything else. Ah, you, should, you, 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 you probably should have paid more attention to that painting then. <laughs> probably. That because that because no, that painting that, that, that painting was heavy foreshadowing for later. That's the thing. I was paying attention to the painting. I just don't remember all the details of it. Well, I don't. Know. Well, I can't. I'm sorry, but I'm not going to tell you who. Well, Google will. Let me give you a. Well, feel, well feel, feel, feel free to go back and check the parts if you want. I think I think searching on Google the actual painting might be more faster. So sure. It's not really cheating because it's something that's already been shown to us. So. Sure, yeah, sure, I'm sure. Try yeah. avoiding other images. All right. Well, I have to tell you, you mind if I do it since I naturally in I can spoil myself because well, I finished I this game. Sure. Thank you. Okay. I'll do sure. it. You guys keep going. Uh, Jova, oh, entertain oh, the fine. Jova, entertain the audience with doing this comment sequence while I search for well, this image. We need we need to profile stuff. I don't think there's much of be lack of us. Oh, this one is also especially murky. Yeah, like I said, they've been getting more murkier and pixie. Well, Shiro, I guess uh, for once we get to we get to understand what it feels like. <laughs> <laughs> Too much noise. We're still missing a vital piece of the puzzle. Yep, again, you are. Oh, Carol's bar is partially on fire in this reality now. Seven Till really took a downturn, and that's saying a lot. <laughs> uh. <sighs> Excuse me. There's probably more levels to this bar that we are not aware of. Um, uh, surprisingly, I'm not having luck finding the painting. Um. Well, actually, no. Hold on. I know. I know what to do. Hold on. More ham. Beautiful. Hmm. York, I don't think this is the right time to consume food, but sure, I guess. No, I'm sure this bar is up to health code. I'm going to use my actual raw and take a and just take a screenshot. You know, Jova, uh, how, how weird must it feel for York if uh, Zaki is talking about he's just a collective thoughts of a couple of people. We can mention one of the earlier parts, but it is kind of like the voices of which place Pokemon. Maybe. All right, here it is. Let me just. Is that thing still going, by the way? Just asking. Sort of, yeah, from what I understand. There was even a Twitch Plays Undertale of all things. Oh, that too, but I knew that the original. You know, we're still going in some fashion, just with different uh, Pokemon titles. Anyway, oh no! Um, <laughs> you come right. here often. Save image. Goodbye. Yeah. Excuse you... me, I have a very important meeting. To you be. are the weakest link. Goodbye. <laughs> Could you give me a time, Teo, please? Go to twenty-four thirty. Twenty-four thirty. I had to leave the, my the part itself so I could. Alright. Oh yeah, German, they actually brought back the weakest link in your country. Alright, I'm ready. Uh, how nice. Okay. Almost there. Uh, and... Uh, yeah. Okay. In the meantime, let me get this... Um, Come on... Don't worry, I'm getting it. <laughs> Wait, he's literally lingering there. Y you, you dummy, you would have us. To You're be fair, Jova, again, we're going for all of the slasher killer tropes, so just that too. He's just gonna stand there menacingly. Wow. He's Be intimidated, please. 
No, I'm missing. <laughs> okay, let's walk slowly in. All right. Uh, oh, so now we're doing a reverse of this. Normally, it's the hiding sections there first and then the running. Feel, feel. Yes, that's not the right thing to smile. Since, since, all right, we're just we're just being chased by the. All right, we, we already know how this section works. You know, I have to hide here, hold my breath. We already know how this works. Feel free to look at the painting. I wonder what if they're pulling a. Honestly, person? I'm not recognizing anyone aside the, from the know, second the, the the second one from the right. Um, Isn't yeah. it Carol? No, Carol oh. has a longer hair than that. Not to mention that hair is oh, clearly maybe black. Be, maybe behind her head. The second one to the right, you say? No, 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 the second one from the right. The one with the short, the, the one with the short black hair towards oh the back there. Who do we know it that has a hair like that? It literally looks like Zack and Cody's mom. <laughs> Jova, more on point, please. Uh, hair oh, situation like requires it. Well, Jova, come on, it's not that hard. Who do we know has a hair like that? Yo? Uh, <laughs> no, sure. Well, okay, do I, do, I, do I have to say it? <laughs> Well, do we find out in the next part? Uh, well, we'll find out eventually, but you know, I, I, you know, I we'll, well, we'll find out eventually. So don't, so don't tell yeah, us. Yeah. Also, for the audience' sake, if we haven't figured out. Uh, yeah. I get the feeling a lot of people didn't figure this out. I'm drawing a blank regarding any women with. Hair. Wait, hold on. Well, Jova. <sighs> okay, fine, whatever. What about older women? Oh, oh my nice god. Sigourney or the lady in the in the hotel, maybe. No, no, no. The lady in the hotel doesn't have. Um, wait, hold on. Wait, they Yeah, but this would version. be her younger self. Here, I'll, younger I'll, version. Let me give you one final latent style hint, Jova. Sometimes it is wise to think outside the box. <sighs> That's one of the most blatant and generic hints you can give. Well, but in this case, it it, it's, it works. I assure you. <laughs> Well, thinking outside the box, it would be someone's younger self, so maybe it's not as we see them now, but as we see them previously. The only thing I'll say is that uh, there's a, pa a breaking of a pattern in this in this painting, but that's... Can we pay you cigarettes for a super hint? <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, sure, the super hint is basically giving out the answer, so... <laughs> I love how he first throws the axe far away, but in the next shot he already has it back in his hand. Again, it's the Leviathan axe from God of War 4. <laughs> I know, right? Me, okay, I, I, again, uh, I'll, I'll, just, I'll just put it like this, Jova. Uh, there's an anomaly in the pattern of this painting. There's okay, like Sesame Street would say. What what does uh, what was the that thing from Sesame Street? What doesn't look right here? One of these things is not like the yeah, other. That's it. One of these things is not like the other. Hmm. Huh. Let me take a close look at it. Um. Oh. I mean, I guess the color of the color of the hair because everyone else is blonde. That too, yeah. Also, the, the, well, else has longer hair than hers. Not well, not not just that. The, focusing on uh, something other than the head. Uh, focus on the rest of the body. Doesn't something look different than the other bodies? Oh my God! It's Thomas. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Jovas cracked the code. I mean, think about it. Think about it. Think about it. It's like how I said earlier, oh, Thomas. It's like I said earlier, Thomas was cross-dressing probably to protect Carol or something because he knew there was a killer out on the loose looking for girls, so he put on a red wig and whatnot, and bam. I actually did notice the first time I played it, like, wait, is that so Thomas? So does that mean that Thomas is dead? <laughs> well, well, we don't, well, we don't, we don't, know, we don't know yet. Let's just see. Not to mention Jova. That, um, that, th th those flashes we saw in his apartment, okay. Assuming your theory is true, that doesn't explain why the raincoat killer was just chilling there. It's almost... well, not only that, but that first thing literally showed Thomas looking like he was praying or something. Hmm. Unless he was a part of the same cult or something. I thought he was just singing in the bathroom. Oh, well, think about it, Shuri. He had to put on yeah. the costume. Someone, in a hurry. someone hates bathroom stalls. <laughs> like, <laughs> think about it, Shuri. He had to put the costume on in a hurry. That implies that he was rushing to do it because he knew the killer was coming. Hmm. Hmm. Strange, isn't it? But yeah, you're right. I guess the reason oh, I did. Oh, okay. 
What hey. the fuck? Uh, what? Thomas's badge. That's that's very wrong, Thomas. You're supposed hey. to present it to everyone else. So. Okay, you. All right, I'm done. You can go in now. Uh, <laughs> thank you, ma'am. Let me crap. <laughs> anyway, anyway, as anyway, as I was saying though, I guess one thing to think about it is like this though. I guess the reason I didn't really gather onto is because like, well. I assume that all the women in that were well women, but yeah, it's right. When you actually consider it, yeah, you have to just look at the stature here. It, 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 yeah. uh, to me, to me, to me. Oh, oh, hold on, actually, um, Thomas Sheriff Batch. It's not entirely obvious the first time you watch it because you might just assume, oh, it's just you know the, a woman the, the who women. tends to have a flat structure to her chest and whatnot, you know. But here, now that we know that Thomas All probably right, was cross dressing, now you take into consideration. So, let me guess, this painting is literally a premonition of everyone who's going to die. I have an idea. Would you say it's, it's a it's deadly a premonition, Jova? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were saying, Shiro? I, I, I actually prefer the Japanese name as well, too. No, go ahead, Shiro. No, it's, it's not even a very elaborate idea or anything. There is um, the um, uh, what's it called? The gas station. The um, the husband. Mm -hmm. yes. He keeps stalking. He keeps stalking the sister. Who else would he expect to show up? Mm, well, huh. that, that, I can tell you, Shiroi, that um, Jack only sh is only prominently in that side quest. He's not part of the main story. Really. I no, because I, I felt like she she started dating him or something, or at least no, 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 sure. Carol has not never dated anyone, at least as far as we know. What happened is that Jack apparently has a thing for her, and he's been semi, but not really stalking her like we've discussed when we saw that that side quest. It, that that's literally it. That's the end of the Jack uh, subplot. Hmm. I guess the general rule is like, well, what comes up in the side quest normally stays in the side quest. Uh, to, well, shit, Taylor, since you brought it up, um, as you can probably guess, we have uh, Ignition Entertainment to thank because they thought that the premonition sounded punchier. Mm -hmm. I heard you did mention this before, and uh, I don't know. I can't imagine we were going again. Resident Evil had a similar thing where it was it's called Biohazard in Japan. Yeah, Biohazard, yeah. But uh, I don't know. Well, I'm talking for this one, not Resident Evil. I do believe for this one. The yeah, idea of being more direct with the red seeds um, feels better than just being deadly premonition like this ominous uh, thing. Well, well to be I fair, Tao, there, there are deadly premonitions in the game. game. So it's not like the title is completely off base. No, no, it's... I know, but, but it, is feels, it does feel less focused. Uh, sure. If, if that makes any sense. My guess is, Tao, the ignition, once again, they wanted to, you know, try to downplay the investigative aspect that Square wanted. Eh, I wouldn't really say that's the reason for Deadly Premonition. I get the idea that Deadly Premonition is probably just a core sounding title that yeah, technically which, does again, still work. It does fit with a lot of, uh, like, it's, it's similar not just for the title, but for example, not this game, mind you, but for example, a box art difference. Well, the American versions start to play more the cool aspect rather than whatever artistic value the cover might have had. Yeah. Not only that, but does Red Seas really sound like an interesting title? Like, okay, let's ignore, you know, how much it has to do with the actual plot here and there. Like, if you just call your supposed horror story or whatnot Red Seas and whatnot, I mean, I know it sounds like a cheap reason, but sometimes a well, title can be a turnoff for some people here and there. Like, honestly, Deadly Premonition is a title choice that I'm willing to defend here and there. Like, I can definitely get Well, why in that they case, uh, question, Teo and Jova. Uh, what do you guys think of the original name uh, back when this was a PS2 game, Rainy Woods? Nah. Uh, nah, no. I get it, it's supposed to be, um, again, an, another callback to Twin Peaks, but it just doesn't work. I, okay, I get the title Rainy Woods, but Rainy Woods borders on sounding just. Silly, and you could say, "Oh, maybe that's the idea." You know, a silly-sounding title, but it's very serious inside. 
Nah, Rainy Woods just doesn't have the right ring to it. Like, I, I'd say even Red Seeds has at least a better ring to it than, say, Rainy Woods. Sure. Come to think of it, I feel like there's a kid's game called Rainy Woods now that uh, I think about it. I don't remember, to be honest, so I don't know. I actually don't remember if they kept the Japanese style in the sequel. Let me double check real quick. Uh... Which title do you prefer, Pedro? Red Seat's profile. Please, what about you? Um, sorry, I was concentrating on the power. What, what, the do you, what title do you prefer between the Japanese one, Red Seat's Murder? Red Seat's profile, the, actually. The, uh, sorry, my bad. And the, 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 the one that we got in the last Deadly Premonition. Which do you think fits more? Well, this one's less spoilery, so Deadly Premonition. He, has, he, 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 he actually has a good point there. Too. <laughs> yeah, he kind of does. To be fair, to be fair, red seeds and profiling is a thing we start doing from the very beginning. Yes, but it's, all, it's also a bit too descriptive. I mean, if you go by that, you might as well call. You might as well just call it the t investigate the murder mystery. The video game. <laughs> <laughs> kind of see where Bibs is coming from on that. Sure. What about you? The one we have here. Deadly premonition. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, surprisingly, Wikipedia doesn't say what the Japanese title is. Maybe they just left Deadly Premonition as the... Pro hmm, let me, do let me see if I can find the Japanese cover of the game. Um, it might have just ideograms or so, I don't know. Well, GameFAQs usually tells you what the title is, even uh, like even without the covers themselves, so let me... Alright. Two GameFAQs! God damn it, lady. I'm trying to get by here. Get back to the ring. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Don't worry, she's gonna be killed by Leslie Nielsen by uh, opening a door. <laughs> 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 All right, let me see. the permission to a blessing in disguise. Um, release data. Huh. Apparently, Teo, the game is also called Deadly Premonition 2 in Japan now. I guess, considering it was more appealing to the to potentially with the West, we just went with the idea of, well, Western aesthetics, so let's keep that. I mean, I guess to be fair, maybe the title Deadly Premonition was more popular across the world, oh, too. Maybe the, the sequel doesn't really have anything to do with the Red Seeds murders, so there's that. <laughs> I guess that's another thing. I guess Red Seed. Red Sea Profiling, yeah. kind of as a title that would only work for like a the, this installment as opposed yeah, to I'm a seeing right here franchise too. name. Yeah, I'm Maybe it would have been worked better as a combination, Deadly Premonition, Two Points, uh, Red Seeds uh, Profile. I'm seeing right oh now. Oh god, then they would have had to come up with a subtitle for each one instead of, you know, giving Using a number of title. Um, yeah. I'm seeing right now too. Uh, in the Japan, the game was only released digitally. Um, and it's literally just that Premonition 2. It's literally the exact same cover and title. Literally, they didn't even change anything. So basically, the West was given pretty much all priority when it comes to the sequel. All right. Well, this is a Western. Well, this is a game made for Western audiences, so I'm Bio not surprised. Westaboo, apparently. Yeah, yeah. At least, at least, it's a, at least it's a better example of Actually, a Japanese of a Japanese developer. Tried to make something that they think the West would like, then bought about Act Zero. Actually, mm -hmm. I forgot to ask, uh, how, how well regarded is the franchise in Japan itself? Uh, well, to, uh, from what I n can tell, the game, the, 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 fran the franchise apparently didn't sell that well in Japan. At least, not that I'm aware of. So, we're by potentially having an Inokuni situation here. For, like, for, like, it happened. To, I mean, Toy Box themselves published it in Japan, and they only published it digitally. So I'm not exactly confident in uh, that Toy Box was counting on very high Japanese sales because let's face it, when you hear that when it comes to that premonition, it's mostly Western people that talk about it and make videos about it and shit like that. You don't really see like I I, I actually do watch um, Japanese Let's Players. Um, I even showed 
a reaction to Shiroi recently about don't, this with Tsushima. Don't, don't, hold in, don't hold for VTubers, with Pedro. <laughs> well, I, 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 it's, it's more of a curiosity. Me, he's not shown me any VTubers so far. That, that's a joke. Uh, continue. <laughs> uh, no, I'm aware. Uh, whatever. I'm v, I'm, I, don't, I think uh, I, I, don't, I don't really see the big problem with VTubers, at least that I'm aware. But the point is, um, you don't really see any anybody in the Japanese Let's Playing scene playing this game when it came out there. That's the thing. I don't think Japan really cares much about this IP. All right, then. All right. See you for the next time, everybody, where um, shit happens. Of shit. So shit happens. <laughs> All right. See ya. See ya. See ya. See ya.